Hello YouTube, it's uh, US Minuteman here again, and uh, I want to do a video about lights. Um, I did a video not too long ago about carry items and what you should carry, and I got into, you know, carry your firearm, you know, uh, you know, you carry a knife as a tool, but one of them was a, uh, a flashlight, it is uh, one, uh, a tool that I think everybody should carry with them. Well, they're especially in their vehicle, in their own home, on their person if you can. And uh, I just wanted to go over um, just kind of a, a few small things here. I'm no expert on lights, but um, you know, throw in my my knowledge, my two cents in. I had mentioned that um, I think this was the light that I I had mentioned uh, in my previous video. It's like a Dorsey. I think you know it was never a tactical flashlight it was just a flashlight I liked um, you know like it's aluminum with a little rubber grip the side um, switch it's an LED and uh, it it's pretty bright I mean you know it's not bad if you can see you know and I thought it was a good flashlight you know but I don't know the lumens on this one. Um, I should probably look it up because I don't know the model. I, I got this a long time ago. Um, you know, when I got it, I you know I was into the cool features and stuff. And what this has is the little lenses and you know for red for night vision and blue for anti glare. And uh, dropped the battery pack. So I thought it was a cool flashlight, but. As I start looking at it as a a carry item, not the best. For one, the button is really, really small. I don't know if you can see that. And uh, you know, the actual button inside the, the little rubber the rubber button is even smaller, so I have to get in the middle of it. Um, don't particularly care for that. And it's it's bright. It's bright enough. Just uh, you know, not the best. So, uh, so yeah, I I decided it was it, I needed to look for something a little different, and um, I uh, happened to, to get my hands on one of these. All right, it is a Tech Light Lumen Master with a uh, Cree LEDs on the side. I don't know. Cree is like a specific brand of LEDs or or what if they're like the best brand I don't know they, they feel the need to put Cree LEDs on there and uh, I looked up this and the 250 right there that's the the lumens and uh, this flashlight I like it's got the back button so you know when you're using it you can use your thumb you know and this one is brighter in my opinion if you can see this so there's the doors door C and there's the lumen mass or the tech light it's a big difference but you know even better is this one has the tech light has an even brighter mode so it has two modes probably doubling it. I don't know if it, what exactly the lumens for the first setting is, but I know that the 250 is the second one, which is quite a bit brighter than the Darcy. Um, better than that, though, it's got strobe effect. Now, that's definitely comes in handy when it's tactical. So, I think what I'll do here is uh, turn off the lights and uh, kind of show you how it is in the dark, the difference between the two. So, so as you can see, it's, it's a little dark in here. I mean, it's not nighttime, so it's not super dark. If you, I don't know how well you can see or not, but... So there's the Darcy. It's not bad. You know. And then when you shine it at you, it's pretty bright. So then compare it to the, the tech light. 
and then the second, the 250 lumens, and the strobe. And then I will show you how that looks like facing at you. So the first, first setting, second setting, and strobe. So uh, all in all, I like I, li I really like this this light. It's a it's a nice small size little light. Good for my hand. Um, I I definitely like it a lot. I I wouldn't. I I probably will get a better one at some point. You know, maybe like 500 lumens or something. Double that. Um, and maybe something with a little bit more defense. Uh, lining on the ends, just so you know, if I ever had to hit somebody with it, you know, uh, have more option there. But as far as lights go, you want to look at the lumens, you want to look at the brightness. Um, if you're and if it's going to be a carry flashlight, make it sure it's small enough that you're going to carry, just like firearms. If you're gonna, you're not going to carry a big shotgun everywhere. You're not going to carry a giant mag light unless you're a duty officer you know, uh, officer on duty. Um, but uh, a lot of these are high-tech small lights are, are pretty bright anyway, so you don't need a big, big light anyway. Um, so yeah, definitely look into it. Uh, tech light is, is pretty nice. Um, I know they have the Tech Light Lumen Master Series has a 250 I think they have a 200 lumen. I think they also have 150 lumen ones, and they might have more. They might have higher. Um, so you know they have different variety uh, for depending on what you're looking for. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so uh, when it comes to flashlights, you know think about function. Um, think about the, the lumens. That's very very important. If it's got you know several different settings like this one does. It's got the strobe. Strobe is always nice. It disorients and blinds. Um, you know, for a self-defense situation, a flashlight could come in handy. And not only that, when it comes to flashlights, um, someone, and I may have mentioned this in my other video, someone was like, well, if you have a flashlight on your gun, what do you need a flashlight for? Well, you're not going to pull out your firearm just to shine the light on a target. She's not going to do that. It's dangerous. It's brandishing, you know, depending on the state laws and all that stuff. So, uh, always can carry a handheld flashlight with you. And, uh, you know, look for good brands. There's Surefire. There's uh, Tech Light. I, I, I like them a lot. Um, and, and various others. So, definitely look for a quality flashlight. And uh, carry it and identify targets in the dark. And, uh, Hopefully they're your neighbors, and uh, I will see you in my next video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Leave comments and questions down below, and uh, I will try to answer them as best as I can. Also, any suggestions you have. If you have any suggestions about future videos that I should talk about, things that I should possibly even review if I can get my hands on them, um, leave them down below as well, you know. Uh, always want to hear from you guys. I also want to, uh, you know, do what you guys want to see. I want to keep this going. I want to keep, keep, get topics, uh, going on. And, uh, that is everything that I have for you today. I will see you all later and, uh, carry on my friends.